Hello, good evening. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, how are you? Hello, how are you? Good, so, so relaxing. Well, today was raining. Very tired. Very tired, okay. So um, it's been a really long day, right? Today is Tuesday, but tomorrow is Wednesday. So we are going to be in the middle of the week, right? And you know, we are almost done with our classes. We are going to finish on Thursday. So you are going to have like just probably a short break, right? Before the next module. So I think that that is going to be good for you. So you will have a short uh, break, right? Va a tener un poquito de descanso. Um, si sí, continúa el otro nivel. Entonces, um, all right. So we're going to start with today's class and we're going to start with today's agenda, all right? Then in this case, we are going to start with the warm up, and today we are going to study like, need, and want plus infinitive. Yeah, so like, need, and want plus infinitive. So guys, um, those are different verbs that help us to express what we like to do or what we need to buy or what we want to do as well, okay? So we also have a speaking and we have the wrap up. Then to begin with, we are going to start with a stop the bus. Yes, but this time the categories are really different. Verb, adjective, and color. Uh, okay, Manuel, thank you. So in this case, we have verb, adjective, and color. Yeah, the three of them, yes? So let's see, we are going to play with three letters, yeah? The first letter is going to be letter R. Yes, a verb, an adjective, and a color with the letter R, 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 R. Mm -hmm. You will have one minute. Mm -hmm. A verb in present, an adjective with the letter R. Stop the bus. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. um, a verb, uh, recommendar or uh, recommend? Recommend, perfect. Recommend. Um, adjective, ready? Ready, okay, yes. Um, color, red. Red. Perfect. Okay, Edwin. Excellent. Okay, so one point, okay, for Edwin. Okay, next letter. With the letter, mm, let me see. W. W. A verb, an adjective, and a color with the letter W. Set the bus. <laughs> okay, let me see Alexandra. Okay, go. Okay, verb wake, mm -hmm. adjective worried, mm -hmm. and color white. Excellent. Okay, very good. Yes. Okay, next letter. Okay, so let me see with the letter P. P. Letter P. Mm 
stop the bus. Okay. Alexandra, let's see. Uh, verb, put. Put. Uh, adjective, proud. Proud. And color, pink. Pink. Excellent. Okay. So, just for today, in this case, Alexandra, yes, is the winner. Okay. Very good. All right, so let's continue, guys. Let's continue and let's start with today's topic, okay? Let me just uh, clear that, okay? So let's see. Let's start with the grammar topic. And today the grammar topic is going to be like, need, okay, Mario, and want plus infinitive, yeah? That is the grammar topic. Like, comma, need, and want plus infinitive, okay? So let's see, we have different sentences right here. Look at this, okay? We have, I like to exercise in the morning. So guys, in the English language, okay? In English, in English, nosotros le decimos infinitivo, cuando se vea infinitive, yes? Um, we mean que lleva el tú. ¿Sí? Al infinitivo le decimos aquel verbo en su forma base que lleva un tú. Aquí, mire. A esto en inglés se le conoce como verbos en infinitivo. To meet, to relax, to exercise. Yes, esos son verbos en infinitivo. Para cuando usted vea ese tipo de estructura. Entonces tenemos, I like to exercise in the morning. Okay, Fabiola. He likes to exercise in the morning. Y aquí estamos diciendo, uh, a mí me gusta ejercitarme en la mañana. I like, me gusta. A mí, I like to exercise in the morning. Teacher, y eso es lo mismo si yo digo, I like hamburgers. No. No es lo mismo. Porque ahí cuando usted dice, I like hamburgers, está diciendo que le gusta una comida. Pero aquí estamos hablando de acciones, de verbos. Esto es un verbo. Exercise es un verbo. To relax es un verbo. To meet es un verbo. ¿Sí? No es lo mismo que decir, I like fruits. I like Coca-Cola. I like ice cream. A decir, I like to exercise in the morning. Okay. He likes to exercise in the morning. A él le gusta ejercitarse en la mañana. Yes. And then we also have need. What is the meaning of the verb need? Need means necesitar. Okay. Entonces, si yo digo, we need to relax today. Yes. <laughs> ok, aquí también relampagueo varía, Vilma, creo que ahí donde usted también. Ok, so we need to relax today. In this case, estamos diciendo, nosotros necesitamos relajarnos ahora, este día. She needs to relax today. And look at this, the letter S. Third person. Yes, he likes, she needs. And let's see this one. They want. What is the meaning of the verb want? What is it? Want, querer, querer, necesitar. Eh, necesitar es need. Okay? Okay. Want es querer o eh, desear. Desear. Okay. Yes. So we have, they want to meet every week. ¿Qué significa el verbo meet? Teacher, el verbo meet significa conocer. Yes. Pero oh. también significa reunirse. Oh. So, they want to meet every week. Ellos quieren reunirse cada semana. Uh -huh. They want to meet. Yeah. And we also have 
he wants to meet every week. Él quiere reunirse cada semana. Yes? So we have uh, different uh, verbs. Like, gustar, okay? Need, necesitar, and want, querer o desear. Pero más que todo se, um, se interpreta como querer en este contexto que tenemos nosotros. ¿Ok? Ahora, vamos a estudiarlo más a fondo. ¿Sí? Lo que le estaba explicando. An infinitive is to plus the base form of the verb. Yes. So, cuando usted vea infinitive, significa esta preposición to más la forma base del verbo. Es decir, así, to play. Este es un infinitivo. Ese es el nombre de la gramática. Infinitive is this. Yeah? Some verbs are followed by infinitives. Look at this. We want to play soccer. She needs to call her a boss. I like to read. We want to live. No, we want to live. Yes? So now, let's study with the structure, okay? Vamos a estudiarlo con la estructura, with the structure. Okay, so right here, we have the following. Look at this, yeah? So we have like, subject, like to, verb in present, plus complement, yeah? ¿Qué quiere decir? Que nosotros utilizamos estas estructuras con todos estos pronombres. Subjects. ¿Ya? Yeah? So, I like to eat chicken. You like to eat chicken. We like to eat chicken. They like to eat chicken. Uh -huh. Y aquí, ¿qué digo yo, teacher? Ok, aquí dice, me gusta comer pollo. Si usted se fija, está enlazando otro verbo. ¿Sí? I like to eat chicken. You like to eat chicken. Eh, me gusta leer. I like to read. Real. Me gusta cocinar. I like, I like. to cook. Yes. Me gusta bañarme. I like to take a shower. Me gusta beber gaseosa. I like to drink soda. Yes. Nos gusta comer. Eh, ¿Qué? Nos gusta comer pastel. We like to eat cake. A ellos les gusta hacer la tarea. They like to do the homework. Yes. So, está enlazando dos verbos. Okay. Ahora, need. I need to pay my bills. Yo necesito pagar mis recibos. Bills, recibos. También okay. contaría como cuentas. Cuentas, sí, también como sus cuentas, sus recibos, sus facturas. Ok. Very good. I need to pay my bills. Yo necesito comprar un par de zapatos. I need to buy a pair of shoes. Pero si se fija, aquí tenemos que podernos los verbos en presente. ¿Ok? Ya los verbos tienen que estar bien, eh, al, al menos unos 20 ya de memoria. Necesito hablar con mi mamá. I need to talk with my mom. Uh -huh. Necesito 
ir al colegio. I need to go to the school. Jose. Hello. Eh, tengo una pregunta. Yeah. Eh, eh, ¿Tú? Eh, ¿Por qué se usa tú? Es como... Um, sí, es que es básicamente, Jose, um, la estructura de estos tres verbos. Entonces, esos tres verbos, eh, para hablar de cosas específicas, utilizamos el tú siempre. Y porque le sigue otro verbo, si se fija. Entonces, para no cometer errores gramaticales y decir, por ejemplo, es lo más común cuando nosotros queremos decir me gusta comer eh, mmm, pollo, ¿ok? Entonces, siempre cuando estamos aprendiendo el idioma decimos I like eat chicken, ¿verdad? Eso sería como algo que lo traducimos, me gusta comer pollo. Pero en realidad, esta oración tendría que ir I like to eat chicken, porque así es lo correcto, aunque sí. pensamos que sí es, ¿verdad? Pero no. ¿Y el tú en español qué sería? No tiene interpretación. Como, no, ah, y gramatical no. nada más. Solamente gramatical. Ok. Sí. Gracias. Sí. Ok. Very good. Uh -huh. All right. So, eh, and we have want, de querer. I want to go to the beach. You want to go to the beach. Or, eh, yo quiero, ¿qué? Yo quiero comprar una computadora. I want to buy a computer. Eh, yo quiero hornear un pastel. I want to bake a cake. Yo quiero dormir. I want to sleep. Uh -huh. Do you have any question? Tiene preguntas, tiene dudas. ¿No? No, oh, teacher. Eh, cuando dijo la oración de la escuela, vi que dijo tú de house, de, de school, pero ¿por qué ah. le puso el tú ahí? <risas> Muy bien, sí. Y es lo, fíjense que es la misma estructura que esta. I want to go to the beach. ¿Se fija? Entonces, I want to go to the school. Este to, es, este sí se traduce. Este, aquí dice, yo quiero ir a la escuela. Este sí tiene como una interpretación, el cual es a, a qué lugar usted va a desplazarse. Entonces, por eso digo, yo quiero ir a la playa. Yo quiero ir um, a Metrocentro. I want to go to Metrocentro. Cuando usted se va, siempre, y esto es, es regla general, ¿ok? Cuando usted se vaya a desplazar a un lugar, esa A es el to. Por ejemplo, otra, otra ejemplo con, sin el verbo want sería, yo necesito ir a la escuela. I need to go to the school. Me gusta ir a la escuela. I like to go to the school. Uh -huh. Ese tú sería como decir a. Sí, es a. Yes, that is correct. Uh -huh. Y no lo puede omitir. No podemos decir, I want to go the beach. No. 
porque el a lo lleva a la, a la playa, a la escuela, a metrocentro, a la farmacia, a la gasolinera, a, a lo que sea, a un lugar. Uh -huh. Any other question? ¿Alguna otra duda? Doubt? Question? Pregunta? Question? No? Ok. So now is your turn. I need to create one sentence with like to, one sentence with need to, and one sentence with want to. One, 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 three sentences. One, one, and one. Okay? It could be I, you, we, or they. Yes? Create three sentences. Yes, Jose, do you have questions? No? No, 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 perdón. I don't worry. Okay. If you have questions, ask, okay? Si tiene dudas, preguntas, hágamelas. La vamos a enviar en WhatsApp o a Katy. Quiero, usted la va a preguntar. Sí, aquí la voy a preguntar. Hoy la voy a okay. preguntar. Sí. Okay, I'll give you two minutes, okay? So you can finish. Okay, ready? Yes. Okay, very good. Alexandra, can you please give us your sentences? Okay, uh, the first one is, I like to dance. I need to relax to have a good day. I want to travel to Canada. Excellent. Okay, somebody else? Uh, okay, Ediselda? Okay, I like to eat vegetarian food. Okay. He needs to go to the gym. Yes. I want to go to the bed early. Excellent, very good. I want to go to the bed early. Perfect, thank you, Diselda. Diana? Diana, you are on mute. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Uh, do you like to listen to music? Yes. Yes. I need to work in the homeroom. Yes. She want go to the park. Mm, she wants go go. Mm, no. She wants to. Ah, she want to go to the park. Mm -hmm. Very good. And number two. Number two, I need, uh, me dijo, I need to work in the homework. Huh? En lugar de in, póngale on. Ah, on. On, on. La tarea. Sí, on the homework. Okay, very good. Somebody else? 
Me? Okay. Me, teacher. Okay, Tatiana? I like to read a book. She needs to go to the hospital. Mm -hmm. You want to cook pizza. You want to cook pizza. Perfect. Thank you. Mercedes? Uh, I like to make my homework. Mm -hmm. uh, you need to sleep more. Mm -hmm. uh, and then they want to watch a movie. Okay. And um, the only observation that I have is that instead of saying make the homework, vamos a decir do. Okay, do. Do, okay? Yes. Siempre, toda la vida, okay? Do homework es parejita. No se puede separar do homework. Okay? Very good. Uh, somebody else? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. Go. I like to drink coffee. You need to depart. We want to have dinner tonight. Okay, number two, once again, I need, or we need to? You need to depart. Mm. And what is the verb? ¿Cuál es el verbo? Así, teacher, no le puse, lo siento, hasta ahorita <laughs> <Okay>. me di <laughs> Very good, but very good. Okay, don't worry, solo agregue. Okay, add it. Edwin? Okay, teacher, I like to go to my workplace. Mm -hmm. You like to play so soccer? Yes. We like to watch a movie. Excellent. Very good. Cindy? Okay, uh, we need to dance in, in the party. Mm -hmm. uh, you want to buy a shoes? Mm -hmm. And I like to cook chicken. I like to cook chicken, okay? So let me see. You, you want to buy a shoes like this? Yes. Bye. En este caso, como zapatos es plural, it is plural, el A lo utilizamos como un o uno o una. Y como es zapatos... No podemos decir, um, yo yeah. quiero comprar unos yes. zapatos. Ya, yeah, ya yeah, entendí. Excellent. Very good. Eh, Jose. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, I like to play music. Mm -hmm. I need, ¿está bien? Yes, yes. Yes. I need to eat my dinner. Yes. And I want to go to my house. Okay, I want to oh. go to my house. Oh, see? Yes, it is correct. Very okay. good. Thank you. Thank you. All right, somebody else before continuing? Again, Mans? No? Okay, let's move. We also have this structure with the third person. Okay, and remember the third person is he, she, and it, yeah? So what we do is that we add the letter S. Look at this, likes to. She likes to eat chicken. He likes to eat chicken. Entonces, al que le vamos a poner la S es a likes. Yes? And then we have need. She needs to pay my bills. He needs to pay your bills. Yes? And want, she wants to go to the beach. He wants to go to the beach. Third person, third person. So the letter S, likes, needs, wants. Huh? Questions? No? Okay. So, what I want you to do is that I need to create one sentence for each subject. One with he, one with she, and one with it. Okay? Like, need, and want. Just three, okay? Three sentences. 
Just three. One like, one need, and one want. Okay, ready? Teacher, uh -huh. ¿va que puedo poner un animalito, un gato, un perrito? Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, vaya fácil. Ah, pues me quedo. Se lo digo. Sería, he likes to eat pupusas. Perfect. Uh, she needs to buy the shoes. Excellent. Shoes. Sí. The cat wants to eat. Excellent. Very good, Diana. Excellent. Uh -huh. Somebody else? Okay, Mercedes. Uh, yes. Um. Okay. He likes to look. Uh. I don't know. Uh. To a sky or a sky. Oh, he he likes to look at the sky. He. Okay. He likes to look at the sky. Mm -hmm. Another. He needs to take a uh, weather. At weather. He needs to take water, water. Oh, mm, okay. But in this case, he needs to drink water. To drink, okay. Drink, yes. To drink water. Uh -huh. And finally, elephant wants to eat a peanut. The elephant wants to eat peanuts, okay. Perfect. The elephant. Excellent. Somebody else? Cindy? Yes. Uh, he likes to bake cake. Excellent. She needs to buy dresses. Excellent. And the dog wants to eat meat. Meat. Perfect. Okay. Somebody else that wants to share? Me teacher. Thank you, Edwin. She likes to eat candies. Yes. She needs to buy a ring. Mm -hmm. Um, no estoy segura en esta, pero if necessary, visit to the hospital. Again. If necessary, visit to the hospital. 
It is necessary. Mm, okay, on that one, Edwin, no. Okay. Um, mm -mm. Another idea. Um, um, no sé. Okay, Astrid. Uh -huh. With it. En it, recuerde que puedo utilizar un animal. En it. For example, eh, the cat wants to eat. The elephant wants to eat peanuts. The dog wants to sleep. Porque el it sustituye a un animal o a una cosa. Uh -huh. Entonces podemos usar animales o cosas. Ok, teacher. Uh -huh. Very good. Somebody else? Alguien más? Me. Thank you, Tatiana. Ok. Uh, she likes to go to do shopping. Ok. And he needs to buy new shoes. Yes. The parrot wants to fly. Excellent. The parrot wants to fly. Yes. Very good. Okay. Somebody else before moving on? Now? Okay. Let's move. Okay. All right, guys. Let's do something. Okay. Right now, let's move to conversation time. Yes, so you can practice these uh, like two, okay, one, two, need two. Sí, en estas preguntas usted va a practicar lo que hemos aprendido ahora. Sí, for example, si yo le pregunto, do you want to buy ice cream? Mm, well, yes, I want to buy ice cream. Respu uh, respuestas completas, complete answers, no únicamente yes o no, ¿ok? Sino que practiquemos lo que hemos aprendido para que se le vaya quedando, ¿sí? Estas preguntas hay eh, tres diapositivas, ¿sí? Si quiere, tómele captura. Uh -huh. Esta es la primera. This is number two. And this one is the last one. Okay. So complete answers. Complete. Okay. Completas esas respuestas. We are going to practice for six to eight minutes with this. Okay. And then we are going to come back and we are going to take the listening exam because we have a listening quiz today. Okay. So let's see. Uh, let's move. Let me create the breakout rooms and let's move. que acá hay bastante eh, sí un, un poco suave pero pero sí 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 la, la alcanzo a escuchar <ríe> ok 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 Mira, este no, le tomó captura no no le tomé captura pero ah no como tengo acá la diapositiva abierta por eso no la tomé pero si gusta se las envío yo las yo las tengo aquí en la computadora ajá yo tengo aquí la diapositiva Do you want to sorry. do you want to buy ice cream? Quieres comprar helado, dice. Ajá. Eh, ¿Tú deseas comprar un, un helado? I want to ice cream. Así sería la respuesta que voy a poner aquí. I want... No, yo le había puesto yes. Yeah. 
Yes, Ajá, yes I like I to want. ice cream. Okay. Yes, I I want. Yes, I want. Yes, um, yes, I want to, to buy to buy ice cream. Ice cream. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, the next. Um, do you like to eat pupusas or pupusas? Yes, I like to eat pupusas. Okay. Yes, I like. <laughs> A quien no creo. <laughs> no, sí. no, but there are people that don't like pupusas. Hay unos que no les gustan las pupusas, ¿sabes? Sí, es cierto. Yes. Uh -huh. O a veces, dependiendo de lo que sea, no, no les gusta. También. Correct. But they are delicious. Pupusas are delicious. Sí. Yes. Yes. Solo yes, las de San Miguel no. <laughs> ah, yes. Creo que le, le echan salsa inglesa. Sí, sí es salsa diferente. negra en vez okay. de salsa de tomate. Mm, no, ok. That one, no. Qué combinación. <laughs> yes, ok. Eh, vaya, the next. Do you need money? Why? Yes, I need. Uh -huh. Yes, I need money. Yes, I need money. Why? Uh, why? Um, eh, $100. Ok, but why? Why? Um, because... Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Because I want to. Uh -huh. Because I want to buy to the shoes. Because I want to buy shoes. Okay. Uh -huh. And buy a. ¿Cómo, cómo diría comida? Food. To food. Because I want to buy food. Okay. Uh -huh. Solo para eso necesito los 100 dólares. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> a lot, okay, but it's okay. It's okay. Okay, continue. Okay, do you want to eat cake? I Elena? want it. Yes, I want to eat cake. Mm -hmm. Okay. La siguiente. Do you like to drink soda? Soda? Mm -hmm. Soda? Yes. No. No, en mi caso tampoco. No. 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 Ajá. No. I like to drink soda. No, I don't like. Ah, no, I don't no, like. I don't like. No, 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 no me gusta. No me gusta tomar soda. Ajá. No, I don't like to drink soda. Soda. Okay. Um, do you... Ya les hemos finalizado. <laughs> Terminamos. Bueno, y creo que ya tenemos que salirnos. Ah. <laughs> Okay, you finish? Yes. Yes. yes? Finish. Okay, let me see. Let me ask you. Let's see. Okay. Eh, Eddie Zelda, do you want to buy ice cream? Eh, no. No want. <laughs> oh, no, I don't. No, I don't. And you, Diana, do you want to buy ice cream? Yes, I don't. Oh, I no. do. I do. Yes, I do. I do. Okay. Yes, Eddie I do. Zelda, do you like to eat pupusas? Yes, I don't. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. And you, Diana, do you like to eat pupusas? Yes, I do. <laughs> and do you need money, Eddie Zelda? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes, I, I do. do. <laughs> okay. Why? Uh, for buy a car to buy a car to buy a car to buy a car and you Diana do you need money yes 
Why? A, to you my house. <laughs> to buy? buy. Uh -huh. To buy my house. Okay, buy excellent. And do you want to eat cake, Eddie Zelda? No. No, I don't. I don't. Perfect. Diana, do you want to eat cake? No. I don't. <laughs> no, you don't. Oh my God. Okay, but cake is delicious. <laughs> okay. El Iselda, do you like to drink soda? No, I don't. Never. <laughs> oh my no, God. Okay. I don't. <laughs> oh, oh my God. Okay, so you are so healthy. Que saludable. Do you want <laughs> yes. to drink water, El Iselda? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Diana, and you? Yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I do. Oh, my God. Okay. Do you need to buy shoes, Eddie Zelda? No, I don't. No, you don't. And you, Diana? No, I don't. Okay. Do you need to work, Eddie Zelda? No, I don't. Perfect. And you, Diana? Do you need to work? No, I have work. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> I, <tengo trabajo. laughs> yes, I have a job. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Let's go back to the main room. Okay, let's go. Let's go back. Very good. Okay, perfect. Let me see. Maria Vilma, let me ask you, okay? Do you like to drink soda? Maria? Sorry, teacher. <laughs> okay, do you like to drink yes, soda? Yes, I like to drink soda. Excellent. And do you want to drink water? Um, yes, I want to drink water. water. Okay. Do you need to buy shoes? Um, yes, I need to buy shoes. You need to buy shoes. And do you need to work? Yes, need to work. Yes, I need to work. Okay. Yes, I need to work. Very good. Mercedes, do you want to buy ice cream? Yes, I want to buy ice cream. And do you like to eat pupusas? Yes, I like to eat pupusas. Okay. And you, Cindy, do you need money? Um, yes, I need money. Why? Um, for my shopping. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay, to buy different things. Perfect. Yes. Edwin, do you like to eat pupusas? Yes, I like to eat pupusas. And do you like to eat cake? cake. Um, I, I, I don't like to eat cake. You like to eat cake. Um, um, como para decir poquito. Just a little. Just a little. Just a little, Just a little cake. Okay. And you, George, do you like to eat pupusas? George? Sorry. Is my microphone is oh. silent. Yes. Oh. Do you like to eat pupusas? Yes, I like. I like to eat pupusas. Mm -hmm. I like and to, eat. to eat pupusas. To eat pupusas. And do you need money? Yes. Why? Uh, I need the boy. I need to buy a new cell phone and new computer very good okay guys open the listening uh, exam okay open it we are going to take that listening a quiz but i'm going to take the attendance okay alexandra giselle present thank you astrid gabriela navarrete Carlos Francisco Escoto. Yes, sir. And let me see. Yes, thank you. Eh, Carlos Israel Estrada. Present. 
Thank you. Carlos Vidal Gómez. Carlos Vidal. No. Um, Cindy Stephanie Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Damaris Milagro Hernández. Damaris. Daniela Lisbeth Martínez. Daniela Present. Lisbeth. Thank you. Um, Diana Beatriz Reyes. Present. Thank you. Ediselda Elizabeth Pineda. Present. Thank you. Edwin Giovanni Espinosa. Present. Thank you. Fabiola Yamilez Díaz. Present. Thank you. Ingrid Astrid Asunción. Jonathan David Sea. Present. Thank you. Jorge Mauricio Gutierrez Alfaro. Present. Thank you. Jose Alejandro Flores López. I'm here. Thank you. Katia Mayerly Granados Jiménez. Present. Thank you. Liliana del Tránsito Aguilar Juárez. Present. Thank you. Let me see. Manuel Alexander Avilés Chacón. María Vilma Cortés Rivas. Present teacher. Thank you. Mario Ernesto Guevara Monge. Present. Thank you. Mercedes Isabel Acevedo. Present. Thank you. Mirna Yamilez Reyes Argueta. Tatiana Abigail Rodríguez Hernández. Present. And Jenny Lisbeth Tolosa Cortés. Jenny. Okay. Bye. Teacher. Astrid, yes. present in the chat. Yes. Thank you. I saw. Yes, thank you. Okay, guys. So we are going to take the listening, okay? Vamos a tomar el listening. Bye. ¿Ya todos están dentro del examen? Yes. Okay, bye. No, teacher. No? Okay, open it. En Zoom, le mandé el link aquí en Zoom, en el chat de Zoom. Bye. Prestemos atención para poder responder, ¿ok? Lo voy a poner tres veces. Three times. Mm, espero que no tengamos problemas con lo de la lluvia, ¿ok? Pero lo voy a poner tres veces. Ok, aquí vamos. Mm, creo que está cargando, ok. Vaya. One, two, three. Hello, this is James Goodfellow from Channel 4 News. Today we're interviewing Sarah Roberts, the star of the new movie, Zombies on Mars, Part 4. Sarah, uh, thanks for joining us. You're welcome, Jimmy. Uh, it's James. Whatever. James. Well, let's start off the interview with a few basic questions. First of all, where are you from? Well, I'm originally from Miami. But we moved to New York when I was three years old. Oh. I lived there until I was 17. And then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. Okay, and where did you go to college? I attended Fernando School of Acting. And all of my teachers loved my acting. Oh, and did you have a part-time job while you were in school? Yeah, I worked at a movie theater. And oh. everyone loved the way I made popcorn. Really? Okay. And how old are you now? Well, I'm only 20, but everyone I know says that I look at least 22. All right. Okay. And what are your hobbies outside of acting? Oh, I love shopping for clothes and makeup and... 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 Did I say I love shopping for clothes? <laughs> uh, you did say clothes. Oh, yeah. Well... Do you want to take some pictures of me, you know, for well, your homepage or your blog? And you can even use them on your Facebook fan page. Uh, I think we'll be okay. Okay, well, um, oh, oh, look, all what? of my fans. Hey, gotta go, honey. Hi, everyone. Okay, thank you, Carlos Francisco. Okay, again, guys. Okay, aquí vamos nuevamente. Eh, teacher, eh, no puedo escuchar nada. Ok, déjeme ver. 
Vaya, lo voy a volver a compartir la pantalla, tal vez así pueda escuchar. Vaya. Teacher. Yes. Eh, solo son cuatro preguntas. Sí, solo son cuatro preguntas. Ah, pensé que seguía. Ah, ok, no, Gracias. únicamente cuatro, ok. Vaya, aquí vamos la segunda vez, ok. Hello, this is James Goodfellow from Channel 4 News. Today we're interviewing Sarah Roberts, the star of the new movie, Zombies on Mars, Part 4. Sarah, uh, thanks for joining us. You're welcome, Jimmy. Uh, it's James. Whatever. James. Well, let's start off the interview with a few basic questions. First of all, where are you from? Well, I'm originally from Miami. But we moved to New York when I was three years old. Oh. I lived there until I was 17. And then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. Okay, and where did you go to college? I attended Fernando School of Acting. And all of my teachers loved my acting. Oh, and did you have a part-time job while you were in school? Yeah, I worked at a movie theater. And oh. everyone loved the way I made popcorn. Really? Okay. And how old are you now? Well, I'm only 20, but everyone I know says that I look at least 22. All right. Okay. And what are your hobbies outside of acting? Oh, I love shopping for clothes and makeup and... 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 Did I say I love shopping for clothes? <laughs> uh, you did say clothes. Oh, yeah. Well... Do you want to take some pictures of me, you know, for well, your homepage or your blog? And you can even use them on your Facebook fan page. Uh, I think we'll be okay. Okay, well, um, oh, oh, look, all What? of my fans. Hey, gotta go, honey. Hi, everyone. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Do you need me to play it one more time? Necesita otra vez que lo eh, reproduzca? Or no? Por favor, teacher. Yes, ok. No escucho muy bien por la lluvia. Sí, algunos por la lluvia no van a escuchar muy bien, ok. Vaya, pero trate de escuchar lo que escuche, no se preocupe. Vaya. Hello, this is James Goodfellow from Channel 4 News. Today we're interviewing Sarah Roberts, the star of the new movie Zombies on Mars, Part 4. Sarah, uh, thanks for joining us. You're welcome, Jimmy. Uh, it's James. Whatever. James. Well, let's start off the interview with a few basic questions. First of all, where are you from? Well, I'm originally from Miami, but we moved to New York when I was three years old. Oh. I lived there until I was 17, and then I moved to Los Angeles to be an actress. Okay, and where did you go to college? I attended Fernando School of Acting, and all of my teachers loved my acting Oh, and did you have a part-time job while you were in school? Yeah, I worked at a movie theater, and oh. everyone loved the way I made popcorn. Really? Okay. And how old are you now? Well, I'm only 20, but everyone I know says that I look at least 22. All right. Okay. And what are your hobbies outside of acting? Oh, I love shopping for clothes and makeup and... And, and, did I say I love shopping for clothes? Uh, you did say clothes. Oh, yeah. Well, do you want to take some pictures of me, you know, for well, your homepage or your blog? And you can even use them on your Facebook fan page. Uh, I think we'll be okay. Okay, well, um, oh, oh, look, all What? of my fans. Hey, gotta go, honey. Hi, everyone. Ok. Bye. Se lo voy a mandar el link a los que no, no escucharon. Le voy a mandar el link al WhatsApp para que lo pueda escuchar y lo haga. Ok. Déjeme ver el resultado. Muy bien. Very good. Ok. So I can see that most of you got 100. Excellent. Ok. Excellent. Bye, guys. Do you have any question before we go? Any doubt? Something that is not clear? Alguna duda o pregunta? No? Ya le mandé el, um, el link. Ok? Alguna duda o pregunta antes de irnos? Doubts? Questions? 
No? No? Okay. So if you don't have if you don't have any question, I'll see you back tomorrow. Okay. I'll see you back tomorrow. Thank you. Bye bye, guys. Have a good night. Bye bye. Good night. 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 Good